What is good everyone, welcome back for another video, welcome to today's tutorial, today we're gonna see how to make fire UK hardcore drill type beats from scratch in FL Studio because I know that a lot of you guys are still looking for the undiscovered secrets of putting that dark vibe signature in your beats so in today's video you'll find out how, pow! And we are in FL Studio and obviously first thing first we're gonna make a melody and it's gonna be a very very dark melody. So I'm gonna start with this pad on Nexus 2 called 5th Dimension number 1. I don't even know what chord progression is this but we're gonna make it work. Yeah, it's sounding dark already. We're gonna use another song. I want to use a texture I mean, shit is dark man Let's try something more ethnic Like a sitar or something like that And I'm gonna pitch it down 12 semitones Yeah At the end of the day, the secrets of making these kind of melodies is just layering down stuff on each other, always making sure that they make sense together. So the next preset is gonna be the Tranquilosity by Vocalize Gravity Pack 2. Maybe another note on the root note, but on the top. Yeah. I also want to add the piano and I'm gonna use the Noir Felt library. As you can see the melody is very very simple so now I'm gonna mix all the elements together. So here I wanna get rid of the low end. And I also wanna push it more on the background so I'm gonna use a reverb. This one here, I'm gonna get rid of more of the high frequencies. So here I'm gonna get rid of a little bit of low end, just to give more body to the first element that we used. And on this one here, I'm gonna use one of my favorite tricks. So I'm gonna put it on one eighth. Yeah. I'm gonna get rid of the low end. And I'm also gonna put a little bit of chorus. You know, it kinda gives more tension. And on this one here, I might apply a half time. Yeah. 
want to make some more mixing to the whole melody so i'm gonna use the golfers first I'm gonna boost the highs a little bit i'm also gonna spread the frequencies a little bit I want the low end to be like this, and then this frequency is like this, and the highs it will be spread out like this. Tiny details. You don't really need to make this shit, bro, but <laughs> you know it just makes sense a little bit. And also a little bit of compression. Now the melody is actually sounding clean and then we're gonna make the second part of the melody but in this case it's gonna be side chain so what we're gonna do is to send this on another mixer channel and there we're gonna apply the effect tricks but obviously you can do this with a lot of other plugins that will sidechain the melody for you but i prefer doing it with the effect tricks because it also reverses the melody other than just side chaining which is another cool trick so let's render again the melody and as you can see this is gonna be the side chain so what we're gonna do now is to get rid of this piece like this and this is gonna be the new part of the melody so another cool thing that we can do at this point is to duplicate the melody and to make it unique for this sample of the melody we're gonna pitch it up like this and this other one will stay normal it is gonna sound like this you know just to give some further variation to the sidechain part of the melody so now let's put the drums all right i want to try pitching down the melody by two semitones damn bro so different vibe yeah Let's grab his snare and let's apply one of my presets in Pandora. Alright, let's start putting some perks later on because I wanna put the kick first. Otherwise, I'm gonna start putting a lot of perks and I'm not ever gonna finish the beat. But, anyways, let's put the kick. Right, 
let's start putting some perks before putting the 808. And it is finally time to add the 808 to the B. And if you guys haven't followed me on Instagram yet, yeah, make sure that you do that right now because I'm about to drop my next drunky with my boy Jay Soul. I'm sure that you guys are already familiar with him. Guys, it's gonna be the kit of the year. I swear to God, it's gonna be, bro. I'm not even gonna talk too much, right? Just follow me on Instagram. Make sure that you tune in because as soon as the drunky is gonna be out, you're gonna be the first one to know about it. Let's go. Damn, chill out, bro. Damn, you see, bro, this area is crazy. I'm gonna show you a cool trick to do in your beats guys so if you put a note like this and then you reduce the velocity to the zero and then you select this slide note right here and you put another note like this on top of it and you lower down this other one to the other root note basically you pitch it down by 12 semitones and you put this other one on the root note like this look And saying this is quality, bro. You're never gonna see this shit in any other tutorial across the YouTube. <laughs> Something that I start doing in my beats is avoiding using too many slides on the 808. I really noticed that the beats sound way uh, easier to rap on but at the same time, way more powerful. And maybe here, you're gonna do the same thing that you did here, but on the other way around. So basically, it will go from the top to the bottom, like this. You know, this cool trick is simply made by one note that is ghosted and another one that brings the area to the root note. As you can see, this one here is ghosted and this other one is just a simple slide note, but brings the area from here with zero level, zero decibels, and here to 100% of the decibel rate to the root note. All right, at this point, what I wanna do is to put some effects, some risers, and the beat is gonna be pretty much that, you know what I'm saying? Give me my flowers, bro. <laughs> nah, I can't lie, man. This beat is late. As you can see, bro, it's very simple to make this kind of beats. You know what I'm saying? Your boy Stapus provides for you, bro. You know what I'm saying? That's why you gotta subscribe to the channel, my boy. If you wanna see this shit 24 7, make sure that you subscribe to the channel. <laughs> Man, today I'm playing too much. Huh? 
So as you can see, the beat is complete. There's a simple arrangement. And as you can see over here on the bottom, we have all these elements that are effects, box, and perks, and this and that. And for the mixing, very basic stuff. You know, as usual, we have some EQ, compressor for the melody, a little bit of delay, pancake, reverb, and EQing, camo crusher for the snare, EQing, reverb, preset for the 808 that comes from my kit Pandora. It's always the same mixing that I do on my beats. Nothing too complicated, but at the same time, powerful. I'm not gonna let you ever listen to the full beat. Make sure to follow me on Instagram at Stappers and also make sure that you subscribe to the channel and make sure that you join my Discord group chat, bro. Link in the description. And bro, if you got any value from the video, I appreciate you for watching it. And my boy, see you on the next time. Bow. Step us on the tape. Thank you.